um, it's about to go down. Oh, we have our oh, Reggie Pizza oh, Man! OB1 plays? That's right, what's up? Oh, All right. OB1 plays? All right, before we get started, what are we supposed to do? Huh, what do we do at the beginning of Obi-Wan Plays videos? We don't wait until the end, we do it at the beginning because we know it's already gonna be lit. Oh yeah, we click that like button, bro. I appreciate it, bro. Appreciate it, bro. All right, we have a couple of dope Nintendo Switch news items for this video, but the first one, it's about to go down. Danish retailer has listed Xenoblade Chronicle Definitive Edition's release date for the Nintendo Switch. First, they list it for May 29th. And so May 29th, Summer Prime. Bro, think about this. I'm going to get to the Nintendo Direct, but when Nintendo upgraded the Nintendo, the 3DS, the Nintendo 3DS to the new 3DS with more powerful, um, a more powerful CPU. You know what game was exclusive to that system? Xenoblade on the 3DS. Could it be the Switch Pro? They do the same thing? Nah, I don't think so. I think this could, ha this could handle, the Switch could handle this game. This is a port of a port. Why do they keep porting this game, bro? I hear great things about the game. I've never played it. I've beaten Xenoblade Chronicles X, which I hear this is actually better than Xenoblade Chronicles X. I'm about 10% in Xenoblade Chronicles 2 on the Wii U, on the, on the Switch. But, let's talk about the Nintendo Direct. <laughs> Usually, when games start to get listed, that means, especially a big game, because Nintendo had this in the last Direct, when things start to get listed, that could mean a Nintendo Direct, or it usually, not could, it usually means a Nintendo Direct is about to happen. Happens all the time, all the time. We, we just got um, GameSpot, GameStop, had about 12 SKUs um, listed into their system. Xenoblade, we just got the release date. That means they probably leaked this or put this out there when they weren't supposed to. Another thing, this Danish retailer also correctly um, posted, uh, it was a Street Fighter um, remake coming to the Switch. It was either the 30th anniversary or the, um, um, the Final Warriors, the first one that came out. They accidentally release the release date ahead of time before and so this very much could be legit it's happened before a nintendo direct could be imminent ladies and gentlemen it's happening it's happening next news item all right we're gonna keep this thing going bro this is also pretty dope <laughs> y'all remember emily rogers she said that she's no, she knows of at least two Wii U, two more Wii U ports coming to the Switch in 2020. And the homie Pierre Schneider, shout out to Pierre Schneider, I've met him before at E3. Pierre Schneider on the latest NVC Nintendo Voice Chat podcast, he hinted to what. Um, one of those games could be actually what two of those games could be this is what he says he says one of them is a 9 out of 10 for me and the other is a 6 out of 10 this suggests that he has knowledge of these games and he works for IG IGN they have connections they know people he's the head of IGN and so um, he also says he can't say much more 
other than, uh, and I quote, loves what Nintendo does with real-time strategy games. So he mentions real-time strategy games within that same segment. Hmm, a real good Wii U port, a 9 out of 10 game, and a real-time strategy game. Pikmin 3. <laughs> Pikmin 3 is coming to the Switch in 2020. I told y'all, when Emily Rogers first said this, I said there's really only two Wii U ports left, in my opinion, that should come to um, the Switch. Pikmin 3 or um, Super Mario 3D World. I think they might save this for 2021 as another Wii U port, just to spread out. The Wii U had some dope games, bro. Wii U was slept on, but... All signs now are leading to Pikmin 3 coming to the Nintendo Switch. This game was so good, man. So dope. Just a fun, 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 fun game. A unique game. Unique game. It's just a un game unlike anything else that I've played. Bro, bingo battle. Better have online multiplayer. Nintendo, bingo battle was so good but it was only local multiplayer if this has online multiplayer bro icing on the cake bro we we paying for online now nintendo all y'all games should have online now <coughs> there is another real he did say now he said something important pear schneider says one of the games is a nine out of ten and the other game is a six out of ten the only other game i could think of that's a six out of ten that's also a real-time strategy game. Wonderful 101. In my opinion, this game is a 6 out of 10. I really didn't like this game, bro, on the Wii U. I had it. I had it on the Wii U. Wasn't really feeling it, man. Uh, or did I have the demo? No, I had the real game. I had the real game. Um, This is a 6 out of 10 real-time strategy game. And so, they could announce two strategy games. Booyah and Booyah. Booyah! Booyah! All right, next news item, bro. If you just got a Nintendo Switch and you're looking to stack your Switch library, specifically get some of Nintendo's first-party games, just games in general, there is a real good New Year sale on the Switch eShop right now. It runs to, bro, <laughs> January 16th keeps coming up. The New Year sale ends on January 16th. Nintendo Direct, could this be the date of the Nintendo Direct? I know dudes in the comment be making fun of how I say <laughs> Direct, 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 Nintendo Direct, Direct, bro, I say it how I want. Um, Crazy sale on games. Nintendo, Nintendo's first party games never go on sale. Forty dollars, twenty bucks off of Nintendo's first party games. Mario Kart, the best-selling Switch game. Splatoon, still lit. Twenty dollars. Um, couple of highlights, bro. I might double dip and get Ori on the Switch. It's only thirteen bucks. I'm getting it. I'm getting it. <coughs> only thirteen bucks. Ori and the Blind Forest, Yoshi Crafted World, only 20, um, 40, 41, Kirby Star Allies should be cheaper than that, um, 2K, um, NBA 2K, only 30 bucks, shout out to Bond, Most, Yuck, I'm gonna leave out some dudes, Wet, um, yeah, the dudes know who I run with, FKA, um, it's only 30 bucks, 30 bucks, G-Boy on the Switch, bro, that's crazy, Ice, um, Civilizations 30, um, Arms, and so, Dra Dragon Ball Fighters, only 15 bucks, bro, crazy sale going on right now on the eShop, pick it up, bro, alright dudes, that's it for this video, what do you guys think of everything we talked about, Xenoblade Link, the release date, Nintendo Direct, right around the corner, sound off in the comment section below, I want to know, but before you go, bro, click that subscribe button, stay up to date, all things Nintendo, yo, boy.
you're still watching this video? That means you like me. You really like me. I gotta hook you up. That's right, we're having monthly giveaways. $60 eShop codes for your Nintendo Switch. You can choose any game of your choice. How do you enter? One, subscribe. Make sure you're subscribed to this fire. Two, make sure you're following me on Twitter at obi one plays and that's it. You're in for our monthly giveaways. But that's not it. It gets even better. Do you want to game with your boy every day? Do you want to join our private Nintendo Switch gaming Discord? Become a member. Three ways to join. One, through YouTube. There's a join button right below this video. Two, through Twitch. Twitch Prime, you can do it for free or just subscribe through Twitch. And number three, the third way to join, patreon.com backslash obi one plays. You'll thank me later. Also, check out the swag, bro. Links are in the description. See you later. Peace.